Okay, this video is, do cell phones increase breast cancer risk? And the answer is yes, that they do. The typical cell phone is a low power microwave transmitter. And by the way, you can think of the cell phone as just adding to what a person's already exposed to. There's some EMF, electromagnetic field exposure coming from Wi-Fi, uh, from just, you know, the Wi-Fi of the computer, Wi-Fi of the router. There's other things going on with phones too. You know, they do a lot more. They also send text messages. There's something called near field communication. Now there's even wireless charges. And of course they do internet. They're not just for phone calls. Um, and one of the big things to know about a cell phone is it opens up voltage gated calcium channels. And that's a big deal. Um, we're gonna talk about that more in a future lecture in the context of the brain. Also, they open up the blood brain barrier. And by the way, you know, there's a lot of hype. Everybody's afraid of cancer, the C word, you know. Um, but I actually think the most important thing to be afraid of is brain damage, you know, cognitive impairment. There's a remarkably large number of people that are cognitively impaired. It is not a joke. I see it every day. Um, but let's just talk about breast cancer for now because this is something easy to lower risk about, Okay. Here's a lady uh, putting her cell phone into her bra, and they even have a pocket. They make bras called a pocket bra where you can put the cell phone in the bra. Um, I don't think that's a good idea. And there's also in the front shirt pocket, a person could put a cell phone in a front shirt pocket. That's also obviously a bad idea. You don't want your phone next to your body. There's something called the inverse square rule of electromagnetic radiation whereby, let's say you're you know, two feet away versus four feet away. So one over the square of two is one fourth, one over the square of four is one sixteenth. And the point I'm making is a small increase in distance causes a dramatic reduction in the amount of exposure to EMF, okay, to microwave rays. Um, and the other thing too is they found that women who carry their cell phone in their front pocket, they would get breast cancer in unusual locations right next to wherever they were putting it. Um, there's also some videos on the internet saying this is not correct. That they, they are quite wrong. In my experience of nutrition and health, there's always going to be corporate industry funded studies to say that whatever they do does not cause a problem. Okay, and again, cell phone companies, billion dollar companies, they can buy any journal they want and they could buy any, not any scientist, but they could buy a lot of scientists to publish whatever they want. So always be, you know, usually whatever comes out first before there's profit involved is true. And especially old animal data tends to be true. Okay, so anyways, here's one paper, association between smartphone use and breast cancer risk amongst Taiwan women. Um, and they found pretty big risk, especially if they carried it on their chest, you know, a five times increased risk of breast cancer. Um, also the ones that were addicted to their cell phones, you know, using it all the time, using it before they go to bed. You know, they, they would have it. And I would say you got to be careful, even if you're using the speakerphone, if you're holding it right next to your breast while you're using the speakerphone and you talk a lot, that could potentially be a lot. You know, the further you get it away from uh, your body, the better. Okay. And if you're worried about breast cancer, keep it farther from your breast. But I would not put it next to your head because then you're exposing your head to all that stuff. So here's just a couple more papers. Uh, breast cancer in young women with prolonged contact with their breasts. And this just showed that right wherever the cell phone was in the in this series of women, um, that's where the breast cancer was, wherever they characteristically carried their phone. And these were women who carried their phone in their bra, you know, all day long while they were at their jobs, for example. You know, many of them for 10 hours a day carrying it in their bra, and they're doing this for several years. And they had uh, breast cancers right where they're carrying their cell phone. Um, this is just one other study shown. The women who didn't carry it in, in uh, their bra, you know, they had less breast cancer. So anyways, my advice, keep the cell phone away from the breast and also keep it away from your head.